Hello everyone. Today we will be solving a C sharp programming challenge on the VCP platform. So I have in front of me a small programming challenge. Um, you're given an array and you're asked to build a set containing the LCM of every pair of adjacent elements present in this array and then find the maximum element that is present in this set. Now uh, open in front of me is the problem st statement on the left side and the code editor with the default code stub here, right here. The compiler is already set to C sharp. Um, this problem uh, tests if somebody can implement function well or traverse through arrays well etc in C sharp. So without further ado let's get started so as i can see here i have the function description which gives me the prototype for the function and the return type and i can see that it matches the type here i can check the input format right here to see what kind of inputs i will be expecting and i can take a look at a couple of test cases right below in the sample test cases tab to understand the problem statement further so as we can see from this array containing four elements one three two four we have to take the adjacent elements as one three three two and two four the lcm of these respectively would be three six and four and the largest element from this set is six which is the answer so I'll just enter this code very quickly right here and then I'll try to run this code and see if it works. As you can see it's passing all the test cases and the messages have been given. Now if I want I can inspect these test cases here to see what is the input, the output and the expected output. For the first three sample test cases i can also try to insert a custom test case right here in this tab next to it in case i want to use it for debugging so when i do this and run the code i'll be expecting the answer to be six and that's the output now i can also change these values to say eight and run this code and see we will get 24 as the lowest common multiple so uh, that's it guys that's how you do it all you have to do now that the code is running correctly is click the submit button to record your final submission and you should get a message here you can see that one test case is not passing for me so I'll check and maybe try to submit it once more and now all test cases are passing so yeah that's how you solve a C sharp programming challenge on the VCP platform